Hello Stampin' Friends. Today I'm going to make this cute little 3D um, little packet. It's got a Hershey's Nugget in it. We haven't made these for a long time so I thought I'd just demonstrate real quick how to do this. I used to make these all the time years and years ago and then you know you kind of forget about it and so it was time to do one of these for some quick and easy Valentine's Day gifts. So let's get started and I'll kind of show you some of the stuff I'll be using today. Of course, this is the stamp set that I'm using. It's from an old set. Um, I think they were like tags something. And here are all the ones that went with it a long time ago. There was another smaller set that also went with it called Very Puny. And for the life of me, I can't find it right now to show y'all, but we'll be using this one from it for Be My Valentine today. The other things that we will be using, of course, is going to be some red, real red ribbon, real red stampin' pad, a little hearts punch that was retired quite a while ago, and then both of these also punches that were retired quite a few years ago. And of course, I need my crocodile to punch a hole, okay. So um, let, let me kind of move some of this stuff out of the way and we'll get started. First off, and leave that kind of there, put this over here to the side. We're going to cut our um, early espresso cardstock. I just did this in brown. We're going to cut it at five and a fourth. Oops. Five and a fourth here. By one and three fourths. So remember, this is what you're going to be cutting it at. Five and a fourth by one and three fourths. So let's get the one and three fourths. And there we go. Now, I am going to score it here at two. And then I'm going to score it here at two. And then at three and a fourth. And now we've made my little box here. We're going to end up folding that up like this. So remember, five and a fourth by one and three fourth, and you're scoring at two and three and one fourth. Okay. All right, now comes the fun part. Let's get out some Whisper Wide, a scrap of that. I'm going to ink up my little pad here. And see if I can't get a pretty good impression the first time. Yeah, not bad. I think I'll re-ink though and try again. That's going to bug me. Uh, let's see how this one does. Probably need to re-ink my pad. Oh, much better. Much, much better. Let me close that and get it out of the way. Find my little punch here. And of course, you don't have to use these tag punches like I am doing. You can just use whatever you'd like. Oh, anything will fit on this. Okay. Then I'm going to use my little bit larger punch and punch out of some scrap real red cardstock. And while I'm here, I'm going to go ahead and punch that little heart too. So I can get my punch open and just punch that. Hey, now I've got all my pieces really. And now the fun part starts, just putting it all together. Might help if I had adhesive. You know, I always forget something. Okay, so we're just going to add a little bit of adhesive to this, this, and then I'm going to stick it on my the front of my little thing here. So we've got that. I'm going to get some adhesive, just put some adhesive in the middle, just enough to hold my Hershey's Nugget in the middle. And then simply fold it up. Get my crocodile. I use my crocodile because that way I'm punching through quite a few things. Oh, you can see if I've done this. Since I'm pun punching through quite a few pieces of cardstock. I like my crocodile, and I already set my little guide here so I know how far in to go every time I'm punching with my crocodile. And then the rest is just pretty easy. 
going to get my ribbon out here. Get it through there. And I'm using the thin ribbon. Of course, you can use it any ribbon you like. Usually this works pretty well. I'm gonna pull this together. There we go. Tie it in one more knot and get my scissors here just to trim it off. So I've got that so far. Find my scissors. Let's do a little bit of trimming. And get that out of the way. Gonna find my glue dots, of course, once again. Have no idea where I put half this stuff. Let's see if I can find a glue dot here. There we go. Put him right on here. I'm going to kind of put him right here so I don't cover up the Be My Valentine. Well, it might help if I actually got the glue dot to stick. Oh, I did. Didn't have much sticky on it for some reason. Okay, put him about right there. There we go. And then the last thing that you need, of course, is some bling. Also forgot to lay that out. And because this was the quickest thing I could find real quick, I'm just going to use this. Although usually I use just the plain rhinestones or something like that. But instead we're going to use this, this. We're going to put a little gold one on there. And there we have it. Along with my mess, we have my little, my little gift for everybody. Nothing fancy, but sure is cute. The little Hershey's Nugget in it. And they make darling gifts. So hope you enjoyed this quick video and have fun with it. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching and keep stamping and scrapping. Bye-bye.